Good day everyone. So today I'm going to show you how to uh, reformat your PC. So if you remember, you already have the Windows installer in the previous lesson. So we will put it here to make this as uh, to install Windows because this is a bottable. Okay? So we will turn on now. Then you can press F12 on the keyboard for the boot menu. While booting the menu, you must have to wait there. Loading both BIOS. That is F12. So actually, plus uh, it depends on the board. Son of the motherboard, uh, the boot menu is F10. So here. So you can see, we already insert, inserted the SanDisk um, USB disk there. No? So we will boot from there because the Windows 11 is already installed on that right. Okay. So we choose the SanDisk, enter, enter to the keyboard. Wait. Is now loading. There you can see loading your bottable USB drive windows for the first. Usually class, in this case, it will depend on your PC. If your PC have a very good specification, this way Windows will load fast. No? So for this now, you can press same. The language, we will use English. No? This one time and date format, English. Then the keyboard we are using is the US. So just press next. Then install now. We must have to wait again. So here, um, since we don't have any um, product key for the Windows because this is a trial version, so for the time being, we will uh, choose this. I don't have any product key, but you can register it later once you have the product key. This is for the trial version, huh? So we will choose. Uh, <clears throat> After we click the next, we will choose here what operating system are we are going are we are going to use. So let us say for example you choose the Windows 10 Pro. No? So by the way I am using the Windows 10 now. No? So you can upgrade it anytime. So 10 Pro, click the next. Wait. So there you are. This is the license terms and agreements. So since we are not going to, we don't have any license yet, no, and this is for the trial version, um, just click, check the I accept the license terms, then next. So here, if you want to upgrade, if you have your Windows old version, then you want to upgrade to a higher version, you can click the upgrade it here. But since we're going to reformat and erase everything, so we will choose the custom. So here and there the custom, if you can see class, our hard drive now is partitioned into three. So three partition, but that is only one hard drive. You will notice that one here because you have the same drive, drive 000. So that means you only using 
one hard drive with three partition so if we will erase all of these to make it one partition so you on all you need to do is to click the, the third partition and click the delete then okay so it is now deleted and allocated no so yeah next is the partition 2 we will delete it again then okay so unallocated again so we only have one remaining um, partition which is not deleted unallocated so we will delete it here then we will choose okay so if you can see class we only now have one drive unallocated since we deleted one uh, supposedly that is one terabyte if you can see the hard drive here that is one tera terabyte so here you have 93 minus the memory no so next we will use only one partition click here then next new so you can see it will display all the size available in your hard drive you no know? just click apply that means we will use all the available hard drive in one partition only apply then okay so okay so this is the reserve automatically you have the partition one the 50 md as a reserve partition so it will create automatically huh? but this is the 931 all available or GB all available for our windows so we will click it here next make sure you choose then it is now installing no so you will wait there, there is a status bar or status or your checklist so you will wait until this will finishing up so running now at 1% so you need to do standby, stay and relax until it is on the finishing up. It will start automatically. No? Now note, if your PC is good specification, let us say that is i7 or even i5 or i3, then you have a high speed or high capacity of the memory and RAM, you can finish your setup uh, just quickly in less than um, 10 minutes. But here we are using the 4 GB RAM, no? So not quite good, but it is uh, the minimum requirements for me. So we will wait. So it is now 91%. It is now 92%. Almost done, ninety eight percent. Then one hundred percent. It is now installing pictures. After installing pictures, the next is installing updates to Windows. Wait, it's almost there. So now we need to restart. It will automatically restart. You can press the restart here. No, but you mo just wait. It will automatically restart.
So if this will be the case sometimes, so in your due to your board, so you can press F1 to continue. So you may now remove your um, USB installer, no? Since it is already done, installing just remove. The Windows is now loading. So there you are, running your Windows for the first time after the installation was done. So starting service. So device is getting ready. So you must have to wait class, huh? you don't need to do anything. So it's restarting again. For the second time, you can. If this will happen, class, you will. You can press the F1 just to continue. So it's almost done, just a moment, finishing up your Windows installation. So. Okay, so we are now setting up the uh, final settings here. So we will choose what region. So we can use the United States if you want, but we, uh, but we are in the Philippines, so we will use the Philippines here. There you are, you have the Philippines region, then yes. You can click the yes and wait again for a moment. So this is the right keyboard. So class, you please choose only the US keyboard settings now. So click the yes. Then you can uh, lay out the keyboard. You can add, but we can skip this one. No need for setting up the layout. So we don't need uh, if we don't have the internet, we can press I don't have the internet here. But still it will continue. Then continue with limited setup since we don't have any internet connection, you can click it here. We we'll wait again in just a moment. So if you want to put the name of your PC so you can put it here, but uh, for this example, we are going to put any. Just click the next. Since, uh, so we really need, so example, huh? some example. Or we can put test. Next, then the password. We will try to leave it as blank. And click next. So here, 
you accept all the settings yes that's it so we're getting everything ready Almost there, so done. So we can maybe later. So we just click it here. So this is class. Uh, the Windows fresh now. We are to check whether you you are using what version of the Windows. You can click it here. No, then you can right click on the, this PC then properties under properties you can see um, your specification of your unit the RAM including you know? then as you can see the windows we have you are using the Windows 10 Pro you know? so if you want to purchase a license so you can register it here, but this is only a trial version. Eh? So that's it, we're done here. The next part will be installing the um, device driver.